Hi, I'm Matt from Duo Security. In this video, I'm going to show you how to install the Duo Authentication Proxy on a Linux system using CentOS 7 in order to protect a generic RADIUS application. I will also show you how to upgrade the Authentication Proxy. This standalone software can be configured to integrate with a number of primary authenticators and handle authentication requests to Duo's cloud service. The proxy can be installed on a physical or virtual host. We recommend installing on a system with at least one CPU, 200 megabytes of disk space, and four gigabytes of RAM. We also recommend using Red Hat Enterprise Linux 7 or later, CentOS 7 or later, Ubuntu 16.04 or later, or Debian 7 or later. To get started, log in to your Linux system as a root user. For this video, we will use PuTTY to access our system. Then open a browser and navigate to duo.com slash docs slash radius. Scroll down to the Install the Duo Authentication Proxy section. Click the tab for the Linux instructions. Ensure that you have the necessary dependencies installed, including GCC, Make, OpenSSL, Python 2.6 or 2.7, and libffi. You can copy the command provided in the instructions for RPM-based distributions from the documentation page and run it in your terminal to install these dependencies or verify the presence of them on your system. Run python-version to make sure that you are using Python 2.6 or 2.7. Our system is running Python 2.7.5. Download the most recent version of the authentication proxy for Unix from the URL provided in the documentation. Note that depending on your download method, the actual file name may reflect the version number. Extract and build the authentication proxy files using the commands provided in the documentation. Note that your extracted directory name will depend upon the version of the file you downloaded. In this case, the directory name is duoauthproxy-2.4.19-1. src You will also need to replace python underscore command with the correct command to run a Python 2.6 or 2.7 interpreter on your distribution. For our distribution, the command is simply python. Change to the Duo Auth Proxy build directory and install the authentication proxy. Follow the prompts to complete the installation. We recommend using the default installation path and default user. We also recommend approving the creation of an initialization script to run the proxy upon startup. Note that after the installation is complete, you need to add your authentication and application information to the configuration file before you can start the authentication proxy service. To upgrade the authentication proxy on Linux, open a terminal and log in to your Linux system as a root user. Open a browser and navigate to the Authentication Proxy Reference, located at duo.com slash docs slash authproxy underscore reference. Scroll down to the Upgrading the Proxy section and click the Linux tab. Download the most recent version of the Authentication Proxy using the URL on the documentation page. Note that new versions of the authentication proxy may have additional prerequisites beyond those installed for your current version. Be sure to reference the dependencies listed in the documentation and verify that you have them all installed. Extract and build the proxy files using the commands provided in the documentation. Modify the commands based on your file name and Python version.
change directory to your newly built installer and run it. Follow the prompts to complete the upgrade. Note that the upgrade retains the conf and log folders and contents from your current installation. After the upgrade is complete, start the authentication proxy service. To start the proxy, use the command provided in the Start the Proxy section of the Authentication Proxy Reference page under the Linux tab. You can check the status of the proxy using the Status command provided in this section as well. For more information on configuring the authentication proxy for Linux, you can check out duo.com slash docs slash authproxy underscore reference.